Well, this movie is about two women um, who could not be more opposite from completely different universes, different cultures, different backgrounds, uh, who have to go on this basic sort of crazy journey to get from San Antonio to Dallas um, in a certain time period. And I play um, a very by-the-book Southern cop who is very nervous because this is a big assignment for her to get to escort this uh, female witness um, to Dallas. And the female witness is played by Sophia Vergara, who is vivacious and full of life and is very reluctant to go to Dallas. So my character has to sort of drag her kicking and screaming uh, to any location. And so it, it creates a lot of really funny dynamics. This is our third movie, my company, um, and my producer partners, Bruna Papandre, and we're just having a great time. I mean, it's it's great to identify characters that I think women will really relate to, and actually women will enjoy seeing uh, in movies. Uh, and I think the people who are sort of best to choose those kinds of things are women themselves. So I think it's really, I think it'll be very clear when the audience sees the movie that Sophia and I really chose these characters, and we thought this was a great story. Um, I think always when you're making a choice that comes from your heart, people respond to that. I've been a big fan of Anne Fletcher for a long time. I love The Proposal and 27 Dresses, and I've met her, with her a couple of times about other things, and she just has this incredible personality that's funny and engaging, and she just loves her crew, and she loves her actors, and she also has this great uh, sense of um, physical comedy. So she's actually been so helpful for me, just coaching me through those very physical moments in the movie. I was talking to my producing partner, Bruno, one day, and I just said, you know, I think I've been watching a lot of Modern Family, and I just really think it'd be really fun if Sophia Vergara and I did a buddy comedy movie together. And she said, that's a great idea. You should meet her. And so I sat down with Sophia, and we just started talking, and it was just immediately clear that we were polar opposites. Um, she's tall and Colombian and gorgeous and every man in the room was staring at her and I'm sort of this short southern girl who's just kind of trying to keep up with her and I was, it just became clear to both of us that we were like this would be a really funny movie. It would just be a funny poster. She and I standing there next to each other. So then we talked about what could be different characters we played and we I pitched her like a couple of different movies and she really responded to this idea. She really liked the idea of she and I on a road trip, you know, trying to outrun a bunch of bad guys together. Rob Krasinski is just fantastic. He brought such great energy, and he's obviously a very handsome man, which really helps for the part of the handsome character Randy. Um, but he's also got this sort of lovable, he played a really lovable character who is sort of um, very noble and uh, you know, he even though he's a convicted felon, he's just he does it all for the right reasons, and he likes to take care of women and protect them from bad guys. And um, he's just a very smart, very talented actor, and we're so lucky to have him here. You know, it's real fun to sort of play too with the culture clash. It's it's you know something that you don't get to do very often in movies and I was really excited to do this movie because I feel like Latin audiences are so loyal and they're so you know they love comedy and they're, they're they love movies and I feel like I've learned a lot too you know working with Sophia and it's been a big education for me you know she sort of helps me understand um, you know her culture and I try to help her understand my culture and it's been that's actually a really great aspect of this movie and I really hope you know the film kind of brings people together in that way you can celebrate you know the idea that you're from different worlds but ultimately friendship is universal.